Hey guys, it's your girl Lady B and you're tuned in to KTTV and Treats. So today we're going to be doing a cooking with B video and it's breakfast time. We're making pancakes from scratch. Yes, pancakes from scratch. But we're not just doing any old pancakes. Shh, don't tell the kids. We're making rainbow pancakes. They don't know yet. Little surprise for mommy. But let me go ahead and give you a rundown of the ingredients we have here. As you can see, we have the salt, we have the baking powder, we have the eggs, we have butter, we have milk, we have the flour, we have the sugar, and of course our measuring cups and spoons in the bowl that we'll be mixing it in. So, everything's laid out. Let's get into this. Now, y'all know I don't do normal size batches, right? I always double all my recipes that I do. Because my family size might be a little bit different from your family size. And my kids might eat a little bit more than most kids. They ain't eating two pancakes each at all. So this is a double batch recipe. So if you need to, cut it in half. Because the regular serving was about eight. So I'm doing a serving of 16. So this recipe calls for three cups of flour. Six teaspoons of baking powder. Two teaspoons of sh salt. Two teaspoons of salt, y'all. Two tablespoons of sugar. Two and a half cups of milk. Two eggs. And six tablespoons melted. Y'all caught that? Six tablespoons of melted butter. Now, if you don't know, this is Imperial, y'all. But on most butter packages, it gives you like the tablespoon amountage. So you know where to go. So this is just enough for my recipe. But that's just a little tidbit for y'all. Anywho, so I'm gonna get started. Let's go. Okay, guys. So first, I add in all my dry ingredients, which that was the flour, the baking powder, the salt, and the sugar. So all that's in here. Yes, yes, yes. I'm gonna mix it together and make a well, so I can add my wet ingredients next. If you don't know what a well is, you'll see it shortly. Be right. So back. guys, this is what my grandmother can cause a well you make a well so you can add your wet ingredients in so that's what i'm gonna do okay so back. all my wet ingredients have been added which was my two eggs my two and a half cups of milk and my six tablespoons of melted butter as you can see the melted butter i just put it in so i'm going to mix this up and then separate it out for my kids surprise all right be back. okay so the mix is all mixed up doesn't it look like pancake batter yes that's from scratch y'all from scratch y'all seen it when y'all say y'all don't believe i'll be making it from scratch baby i do now y'all see i got two other bowls over here this is what i mixed the butter in don't mind it i think i'm only gonna do three colors which would be the pink the purple and the blue i think that's what i'm gonna do not 100%. Don't quote me. Might do more. But right now, I'm thinking three colors. I'll be back. I'll add the full coloring to each of these. Time to mix. Yes! The purple and the pink. Blue. Might put a little bit blue. It's blue. It's like a tilly blue. But yes! My colors. Time to make the pancakes. So, I had my skillet preheating and I'm starting off with the teal or blue pancakes now the kids are in the dining room i don't want them to hear me this is their little surprise so starting off with these and then i'm gonna do the other colors i said i might as well do the same color and then just they can have one of each color i think it's cool something cute cure for the kids all right guys be back so if y'all wondered if they still brown yes they do but here's the pancakes had them in the oven so they will all stay warm. I'm gonna give them a color of each. All right, so I'm gonna put their plates together before I cut them up, y'all. Here's their plates. Yep. So there are the rainbow pancakes, pancakes from scratch, and I put a twist to them. So the kids are ready to eat, so they finna smash. See you guys later. To up, be out, peace. 